sit on that sofa and you turn, you turn to my emotions. You take me out of my misery. You're not going anywhere. I have clients that are waiting for me. Woman, if you know what is good for you, you get out of my way. <laughs> Yes, I'm fine. Okay, the, the team from Nest Oil is here. You just came to inform me. Okay, let me get ready. in hitting you again? No. He didn't hit me, Daddy. Listen, for how long are you going to start doing this? With this thing called the precious thing called the rest of our life. Daddy. Putting off lies, defending my stupid son. Why? It wasn't his fault. I was in his way. He had a very important meeting to attend to. And so he pushed me. Okay, but does that justify him laying his hands on his wife? Hmm? What would it. people say? What would the tablets say? The newscasters, the bloggers, how would they describe this? That a millionaire or a billionaire whose son molests his wife? I didn't know. Daddy, promise me you won't say anything. Eh? 
Well, I just want you to forgive me for everything. Forgive you? Yes. But Daddy, you haven't done anything wrong. I brought him into this world. So it's my fault. I wish I would have. It's my fault. That is not your fault. It's really not your fault. Please, if you love him, if you love us as much as you claim, you won't say anything about this. For how long will you keep blackmailing me emotionally like this? See, look at me. I love you. I love you so much. Everything that you want, just let me know. And I will do it for you. Please. It's okay. Thank you, Daddy. So it's okay. I hope that you would understand Oh my darling, I wanna say that I love you Love you, love you You're the love of my life You're the reason I smile Sorry, sorry. He's not been in again. Sorry. Don't worry, just enjoy his meal. No, 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 Toby! Come on! I will not have you come to my house and dictate what you feel I ought to do and what I shouldn't have done. I would not! Miguel, what do you want me to tell you? The truth that will make you cry, or the lies that will make you smile. What is the meaning of all this rubbish you're saying? I'm trying to tell you that it was wrong for you to lay your hands on your wife. That's all. Toby, I will not have this conversation with you. You will have this conversation. I said I will not have this conversation. You will! Mikkel, you will! Why do you give your wife the hell that you give her? Why? Toby, you need to watch it. You are beginning to get on my nerves. Mikael, if you don't stop what you are doing, your marriage will come crashing down at your feet. And what is that supposed to mean? Is this supposed to scare me or something? What is wrong with you, Mikael? It is you, ABA, my father. It is the three of you that is wrong with me. Mikael, we are only trying. We are. I don't want to have this conversation. I am not going to have this conversation. Who are working out on me, bro? Mommy. Yes, my love. Why are you and daddy always shouting at each other? Because your dad is a wicked man. What did he do? The question is, what did he not do? Your dad is only capable of doing wicked things. Hmm? Don't worry, my dear. You're just a child. You won't understand. Hmm? Let's go. Thank you. 
Thank you, Daddy. Take care of yourself. Mm? We will. My hand actually feels good. Right. You are not going anywhere, Habax. Get your hands off me. Never. Sit down and let's discuss the way forward. You are trying me, Habax. You are trying me. I am not having any discussion with you. Okay. I said leave me alone. You are having this discussion today, Habax. You are. You are not stepping your feet out of this house. Please, I, I, I'm Habats. warning you now. Habax. I'm hey. warning you. Hey. Hey. I said leave me. What is, what, what is your problem? Habax. Habats! Habats! I'm warning you! I'm warning you! Habats, you are not going anywhere. You are not going anywhere, Habats! Get your hands off me! Never! Sit down and let's discuss the way forward. You are trying me, Habats! You are trying me! I am not having any discussion with you. I said leave me alone! You are having this discussion today, Habats! You are! You are not stepping your feet out of this house! Where are you coming from? Your father's house. We have a minor misunderstanding and you run to my father? Did you just say minor? Turn him off. I've done everything possible to turn him off. It doesn't work. I've done everything humanly possible to put a smile on his face. But it's like the harder I try, the further he gets away from me. Honestly, I don't know what else to do. I love him so much. It's like there's this really huge wall between us. Every time I'm trying to break through and run through the wall to get to him, but he's just so far away. It's like he's here and I'm there all the time. Even when we're on the same bed, he's distant. <sighs> I don't know what to do. I'm tired. I don't know what else to do. I feel like I'm losing my mind. Do you think it has anything to do with the child you guys lost? It's always been this way. I've tried to, you know, lure him into bed so that we can make some babies, but he's just... 
don't know. Sometimes I feel like I'm not hot or not sexy or I'm not fine. I don't know. Baby. I'm tired. Baby, pull yourself together, okay? How? For how long? How, how, how long am I going to wait? I know this is not going to last forever. It's definitely going to pass. Put yourself together. I don't even know what, what is wrong, but I don't know what is going on. I feel like I'm dying. I'm really tired. Honestly, I'm tired. I'm tired. I am tired. Don't do this. Don't do this, okay? You got this. Don't do this. Mikkel, come in. Dad, how do you know I was the one knocking? Mikkel, the tenderness of your knock, your mom don't knock that way. Your mom bangs the door. Okay, Dad. All right, Mikkel, my boy. Dad, mm -hmm. why are you always fighting to my mom? Why are you wicked? Mikkel? Yes, Dad? Your mom told you that? Yes. That I'm wicked? Yes, Dad. Don't worry, your mom is just playing with you. Okay, hmm? Dad. Don't worry. You can go back to your room. Hmm? Go to your room. Hmm? Okay, Dad. Good. Hmm? I have a business trip to attend to in Kano. 
and you didn't care to tell your darling wife? The last time I checked, I don't think I needed to throw a send-off party to attend a business trip. Oh, well, you would have told me now. Look, if you check your phone, there's a credit alert of 300,000. Use that to buy anything you want and stay out of trouble. Really? Hey, hi. Um, I... Are you stalking me? Maybe a little bit. <laughs> I see. I just wanted to... I wanted to ask if I could, you know, if we could be friends. Sure, that sounds nice. Okay. Can I get your number? Of course, but at least I have to know your name first. So what's your name? Um, ABA. Mikhail, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So show me to be do that day. I hope that you would understand. Oh my darling, I wanna say that I love you. Yeah. Let me love you. You're the love of my life. You're the reason I smile. And you're the reason I'm broke. Oh, my darling, I want to say that I love you. Yeah. You're the love of my life. I'm in love with the wounded lover. And any time where I show my love, be like, say, at the stop, I'm dagger. Cause nothing I do is good enough. Well, Lord, I want from you is to let me love you. Oh, my darling, let me love you. Kept me waiting. Yeah, I was busy. Really? Yeah, I had work to do. So you're not gonna apologize? 
Oh, um, I'm sorry. You're the love of my life. You're the reason I smile. And you're the reason I go. I'm sure you must have been there before. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> Had to ask, right? Are you always this way? Am I always this way? How? You know, withdrawn. I'm sorry, I'm lost. What do you mean? I mean, half the time I've been the one initiating the conversation, asking the questions. Making small talk. But anytime you initiate the conversation, I always respond to you, right? Yeah, you respond. How about you initiate conversations? You know, ask me a question, I'll answer. Right. Are you an introvert? <laughs> I guess I am. So. What do you mean? You were serious when you said you don't have a girlfriend. Mm-hmm. Are you for real? Yes. I mean, you are handsome, you are rich, you are cute, you are hot. And you are single. Like, every queen will die to be in your arms. <laughs> oh, I'm serious. Come on. You know you can tell me. Tell are you, you are you straight? What? No, no, of course, yes. You know you can tell me, right? No, look, I'm a straight as a ruler. I, I promise you, I'm a straight as Indian hair. Yeah. Yes. One hundred percent. Without question. So can I be the one? When you say, can you be the one, what do you mean? I mean, can I be the only woman in your life? The one you would love forever. So should be the bit to that day. I hope that you would understand. Oh, my darling, I want to say that I love you. You're the love of my life You're the reason I smile And you're the peace and I'm broke Oh my darling, I wanna say that I love you yeah. You're the love of my life I'm in love with the wounded lover and any time where I show my love Be like, say at the stop from Daga Cause nothing I do is good enough Well, Lord, I want from you Is to let me love you Oh, my darling Let me love you Thank you for a lovely night. 
Yeah, I had fun. I had a great time. Honestly, I was starting to think my name had become loneliness. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah. Well, anyway, I guess I should start heading out. So it's good night then? Yeah, I guess it's good night. Alright, good night. Would you like to come in? I made dinner. Oh, it's actually your favorite white soup. I said, what is going on here? Miguel, it's your birthday and uh, we are here to celebrate with you.
What is going on in my house? Who brought all those useless people into my house and who gave them permission? Baby, it's your surprise birthday party. Look, I want you to go downstairs, clear all that rubbish, tell all those useless people to leave my house this minute. What are you talking about? If you're not going to go downstairs and clear them, I will do it myself. We're all here to celebrate you. It's your birthday. Excuse Excuse This honorable ladies and gentlemen, this party is officially over. Before I open my eyes, I want all of you out of my house! I said get the hell out of my house! Leave here! Leave here! Get out of my house! You caused this! You are the one who caused this! Get, get out of my way! stopping you from filing for one.
Ah, how far now? How you doing? What's up? Ade, what did you do? Man, just one small part where I need to send out now. I kept trying your line yesterday night, uh, you were not responding. Yeah, my phone was on, it was disturbed, man. I had to rest. Okay. So, why didn't you not come to the club with your father and your wife yesterday? I'm sorry, what did you just say? Wait a Why did you not come to the club with your father and your wife yesterday? My father and my wife were yes. at the club yesterday. Yes. Wait. You didn't know your father and your wife came clubbing yesterday? Mikael. Excuse me. Mikael. my father's house? What are you talking about? What kind of beast is this? You are the beast! What do you mean what kind of beast is this? This madness! How can you be sleeping with your son's, your son's wife? You're, you're still the one that took his, took his mother's life! You killed my mother! You need to stop this, okay? This is enough! Oh, you shut up, you whore! You are adulterous. You dare speak to me. Look, you will go in there and you pack your things because you're living with me right now. I will do no such thing. Oh. Yes, I am done. I'm done with this thing, this sham that you call marriage. I am get done. done because you yes. Now get out. Get out. You better get out of my house. Move. I said, get out of my house. I'll be back. Oh my 
darling, I want to say that I love you, yeah, you're the love of my life, I'm in love with the wounded lover, and any time where I show my love, be like say at the stop from dagger, cause nothing I do is good enough. I am still finding it so difficult to understand what you have been trying to say. Mika, what are you talking about? Your friend is sleeping with my father. God forbid. The only thing that God will forbid is if when I go and pick up your friend, she does not enter my car with her luggage and come home with me. That is what God will forbid. Mika, this thing you are saying is an abomination. This thing, Baba, clean your mouth. Clean your mouth. What, what do you mean? mean? What do you take me for, Toby? A liar. Wait. Wait. What are you trying to tell me? That your father and your wife are shagging. How, how do you want me to believe that? You can't even say that complete sentence without feeling sour in your mouth. It sounds impossible to believe. But it's the ugly reality that I'm living in now, Toby. Could that be the reason why I saw them at the club the other night? On getting to the house, you know what I saw? I saw my father holding my wife's waist. Holy shit. My words exactly. I'm, I'm speechless. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Mikael. How romantic. What? Mikael. We're in the public. We're in public? Yes. Don't you feel ashamed doing what it is that you're doing? Oh, please. Shut up. So you're out here sleeping with your son's wife? What? How dare you? Me? How, how dare me? Yes. So what do you think you're doing? You're standing up to fight me? Do you want to fight me? After sleeping with my wife? treated like unwanted furniture in your house? How I treat my wife is none of your business. Now give me my wife so that I can leave your house. You don't know what
what you are talking about. She does not need you. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. Yes. Haven't you done enough damage to me already? Have you not destroyed my life enough already? This beast that you see here, you created it. Yes. You don't know what you are talking about. I don't know what I'm talking about. Yes. You ruined my life. You took away my joy. The same way you took away my mother. Now, hand me my wife. Father, I am not your father. This has to be some type of a joke, right? I did not kill your mother. On the contrary, And you care your mother killed me. When I first sighted your mother, I said to myself, I had found a wife. I had found a woman of my dreams. So I thought. Then I made her. I got her to love me. After three months, I proposed and we got married. But we didn't have a child. After two years of our marriage, but because of the love that I have for your mother, One million children cannot be compared to the love that I have for her. For that two years that we were married, I never knew that Ajoke, your mother, was seeing another man under my nose in my matrimonial home. After then, when I find out, I did my findings and my research. I was sickened because people were, were saying a lot of things, rumors. And I find out that my love was shitting on me. He pierced a knife in my heart through my soul. Then later, She was pressing for a divorce. But I said no to it because of the love that I have for her. The love that I have for your mother was stronger than adultery. I love her so much. I couldn't let her to go. Only for her to tell me that she was pregnant for that said man. It was painful for me. Even though when she was pregnant for that man, I couldn't let her go. Because I love her joker so much. I didn't even know whether she used a spell on me. Because her joker was all the air that I breathed. I begged her to stay. But she needed separation. 
because of the tears that have gone through the drain. She couldn't leave. And she's still with me. I was happy. When she said she was going to stay, I was happy. We are happy together. She agreed. And I also agreed that I was going to be the father of that child. And I promised her never to tell that child or anyone the secret between us. And she also promised that she was not going to tell the biological father the truth. Then, after a while, your mother started throwing tantrums. Any little provocation, any little time, she would pick offense. She didn't even want to hear my voice. My face make her to even throw up. My voice irritates her. She said a lot of things. She told you a lot of things about me. That I was a wicked beast. Whereas she was the beast. I fought so hard to make sure that I give you the best in life. Everything that will make you comfortable. I fought so hard. And as God will have it, I became very, very big. The whole world, the whole world know my name. I flourish in my business. But there was something that was missing, which is a joker. That vacuum was still there. I tried my hands on, on some other women, but there was no way. Then I decided that I was going to focus on the only two things that I have in my life. Which is you and my company. I want you to know that I love you so much. The love that I have for your mother, Joke, I have been pouring for you. And I will continue to pour that love for you. I am very sorry that I have not been able to tell you all this why. Why you have been acting funny, thinking that I was the one that killed your mother. But I'm not the one. I am very sorry. Please forgive me. I want you to find it in your heart to forgive me. You are my son. Forgive me. So show me to be do that day. I hope that you would understand. Oh my darling, I wanna say that I love. You're the love of my life 
You're the 